intensity will be ramped up a notch. It's finally here. It's playoff hockey. To be honest, they won 5-1 in a game that was not close. Turnover behind the zone. Peller in centering play to Gell scores! Just a minute and 20 seconds into it. Off of a turnover, Dave Gow. A turnover in the corner. And Jeff the Pest Pellerin gets knocked aside. Milani banks it off the board. Steve Best with some speed down the wing. Pow going to the net. Back to Pow and Pow knocked it down, but he couldn't settle it on his stick. Pow with speed up the center of the ice. He tried to go five hole. Glenn Forbes White paddled that into the corner. Back to the left point. Pow down low. Sharp angle shot. Rebound down on the side. Forbes White sits on top of it. Milani had his head up in the air like he had celebrated. And it's a nice save. Pow on the side of the net. And that one was a close call as Jeremy, or sorry, Glenn Forbes White. Pow, going the other direction. They do have the man advantage. Rivers with them, drops it back to Volani. Volani cuts to the side. Oh, he had Forbes White down. And Volani sent it sailing. And the Tigers get away with one there. White, McNair off the right side. Ryan Full. Shovels it towards the center. Brandon Taylor with some speed, with some intent. Tries to chuck one in on net. That goes off the back. And Curtis Villani had the puck tied up in his head to Kubik. Kubik down the other way. Full in space. Shot on goal. Rebound pops free. And that one's kicked aside. Set up. Gebert. Kubik. Kubik to Gebert. Gebert looking to shoot. Gets it through traffic. Rebounds right there. Stapleton trying to jump on it. Sammy, we might get back to you in a second. We're just getting your mic worked out. We're going to ask you your second in a second once again. And a shot off the whistle. And it's a goal from an unlikely place. Greg McNair took the shot, I think. And that's exactly the secondary scoring they need. Greg McNair. Most. And the Tigers might have a jump in their step off the back of a McNair goal. Stapleton enters the zone. McDougal fires a shot. Rebound pops free. Villani drops it off towards Best. Best with some speed. Best in tight. Best around everybody. And a great save from Glenn Forbes White on the leading goal man for the Red Wings. Bit of an intentional pass across the crease. Tate down low. Gal with a goal already in the game to Wise, Wise with a lane shot and stepping in to make the save, Glenn Forbes White. That was a nice challenge from Glenn, uh, being very active on that shot. Uh, just being able to play your game. Stapleton cuts towards the front of the net and he bowled over a player and doing it to McDougal. <laughs> Gloved down by Tyler Leeming. He goes up the middle of the ice, Leeming with a danger shot. That got tipped and Glenn Forbes White. Back to even strength, chipped across the neutral zone and Steve Best out of the penalty box, in all alone. First Glenn Forbes White and Glenn Forbes White, they score! Glenn Forbes White made the initial save. He can't believe it. And Steve Best is right out of the penalty box and he puts the Red Wings right in the lead. That's a nice finish from Stevie, but a great example or a horrible example for Tigers. When you're on the power play, you got to know the clock. Uh, so out of the penalty box, Steve Best makes it a 2-1 game. McNair, long shot from the point, rebound, scrambling in front of it, playoff Greg making his presence felt once again. Up to Ryan Full. Can they set something up with just 50 seconds to go on the Agile Group power play? Full to the net. Big save again from Curtis Villani. Yeah, like 10, 11 goals a season. It's good to see and they need to use that. Glenn Full over towards McDougal. Fires a shot. Villani got down. He made the save. Joey McDougal thought he had one, but Villani again. Defense dropped a little bit too deep. You want to kind of engage on that battle closer to the blue line instead of letting Letting players walk in like that. Just, just to give that little bit more extra offensive pressure. Kubik behind the net, looking for someone. He had full, creeping into the slot. It goes back to the point. McNair, a long shot through traffic. He's got their only goal. Up Lots of time to try to tie this game and maybe get it to overtime or even score a couple and win it in regulation. But Tyler Leeming, the danger man, with a puck, gets it to Gow in front, yeah. scores! Leeming to Gow. They may have been apart for the last eight games, but they didn't lose it. Dave Gow with his second of the game, and it's a two-goal mark for the Red Wings. Corner there from Leeming, his head up. He saw Gow coming in. Great move. I think Ryan Foll was just a little bit slow to get back on his man. There was no one in front of the net, so, you know. Backs it up to the point. Tate 
Didn't get all of it, but Steve Best has it go from shot in front. Big save forms White. Rebound down low. It was an acrobatic play from Villani, but he couldn't get a stick on it. Back to the point for Boyle. Over to Kubik. Kubik. Tigers need a goal. Bad. Rebound. Puck was there. Tigers couldn't settle it down. And the Red Wings pick it up, and they get hauled down. And the Red Wings are going to go to the power play. play. Keep away if they want. But Glenn Full creates a turnover. Gets it to Ryan Full, but they couldn't connect and finish it off. Neutral zone. Long uh, pass just ahead. Go, just control the puck. Steve Best off the boards, in the slot, Leeming ices the game. Tyler Leeming with a goal and an assist. And Andrew Stapleton getting a late penalty for unsportsmanlike after slashing the puck out of the net. But the Red Wings up 4-1, they're gonna win game one. Yeah, look, uh, very very good work from Steve, who just caused a huge turnover there. and. I think Fole got caught, both Foles got caught trying to do a little bit too much and feeding it back to each other. So.